I started growing the show and run gold variety of the Fasalis uh, Peruviana, the South American ground cherry, about four or five years ago. Um, I started from seed and I put two in each pot and I think I had five of them or something. Um, now over the years, I've found that putting two in this small pot is not, doesn't work. Look, this one, it looks okay. But it's just beginning to uh, flower a tiny bit. We got some flowers right there. Um, but let me show you the others. I've since um, taken cuttings from these, which is really easy to do. You just take a woody part of it, not the top, something from the section, in the middle, and you would probably cut this off, cut it off here, cut that off, and then cut it off right about here. And just plug that in the ground and you'll grow a new plant from that. I've done that several times over the years too. Here's one of the originals that had two in them that I pulled one of them out. So now this one is much more vigorous. Um, I've got a lot of cherries popping on it already, which is real encouraging. Usually I'd have to wait till August, September before I got anything close to that and here we are second week of June and this is is flowering out really nice this is one of the ones that does have two in it too and it looks a lot better than the other one this one I've pulled one of them so again looking a lot better they are still in uh, I think they're like five gallon pots so I did take one cutting and put it in a giant pot over here and now this is my best one it's really vigorous it's flowering out all over it's just kind of going crazy and i'm letting it letting it just go and propping it up where i can so it takes a while for these to really get going but i think i'm gonna have a nice continual harvest with these coming up if i keep them going so they do take a while to get going but it is worth it. They're great tasting. It's a beautiful plant too.